Hi guys, it's Cindy A. Lewis, and if you saw part one of my stickers collection, then you are ready for part two. If you didn't see part one, you can go back and watch it after this. So I'd like to welcome you all to my channel. If you're new, thank you. I hope you enjoy this tonight. And if uh, you are interested, you can subscribe. Just click that subscribe button and the little bell next to it. And if you are one of my YouTube family, I just wanna give you a big hug and thank you for coming back tonight to watch this video. I really appreciate you all. And when you share it and comment and like my videos, it really helps my channel and it helps my channel grow. So thank you so much. I'm just overwhelmed with the love for you all. And let's go into part two. If you notice, I filmed it right after part one and there's no shame in that. Okay, let's get started. All right, are you ready? Ready? Okay, so I'm gonna start with the animal type, um, you know, related to nature, but animal butterflies. I have a lot of butterflies too. So we're just gonna get started with that. Look at these adorable monkeys. Now I know you've seen those, those are more recent. Then I've used some sloths. Aren't they cute though? These are all that I have left. <laughs> I used a couple and some leaves. I love the sloths, they're just adorable. Now these kitty cats are so funny, you guys. So funny, love these. And these are the thicker stickers. Um, what do they call them? Puffy, they call them puffy stickers, all right. And then I have a few more puppy stickers. These cute, adorable tigers. Love these eyes. And then these birds. Aren't they cute? They do look like angry birds. All right, so let's see. Let me do that. Okay, then there are some froggies. I love these froggies. Is that a tadpole? Sure enough. And then, well, I don't know. At what stage are they tadpoles? This one, and then this one is starting to, well, this is just the life of a frog. Okay, all right, let's see. These, now these are kind of a mixture. They've got butterflies and flowers with the mason jars. You can see why I just want to buy these, oh, I tell you. All right, and then we've got these, these cute llamas, no dramas. Cutie wooty, I love the sunglasses drama. Drama llama, does that make sense? I don't think so. Okay, and then these birds, a little flamingo, a toucan, a peacock. Aren't they cute? I don't know what, I think I commented on this owl. I don't know why he's so angry. Why are you angry, owl? Okay, I don't know. Anyway, these Catterday cat stickers are so cute. I have two because I picked up one and then the next time I was at the store, they actually had them again. So I went ahead and picked it up. And then this cute puppy. Are these cute? And I, they're telling you how cute they are because they have the word cute on there. <laughs> so they are cute, aren't they? All right, so I have a lot of butterflies. I'm gonna get to those kind of all at one time. Then I have some owls. Now these are cutie wooty owls. They're not angry owls. And I love that this one has a tree. Is that sweet? And then I've got one more owl. Now this one has um, those googly eyes and you get 25 stickers here. Good deal. And then I found the kitty cat one too and puppies. So, all right, now butterflies. I guess I tend to butterflies, so I have a lot. So I have these, aren't they pretty? Oh, I love these. I mean, we could make those actually, but I just, I don't know. And then I'm sure you've seen these before. So I have these, I have the blue ones and the green ones and I'm telling them out of order. This is blue. I do know the difference in colors. <laughs> this one's green, and then these pretty, I don't know, orange, black, yellow, yellow, yellow ones. So anyway, very, very pretty butterflies. I have these white ones, which I really like. Do you guys like white on white? I just think that's so elegant. And then 
here is these that look like old time vintage looking. And then I also got the hummingbird one like that. And these are called just craft, but they are thicker. And so they're gonna be, they're gonna stand out. And then I found these. These are really cute. These are so pretty with the flowers and the butterflies. Oh, they're very vintage looking. And then a different set that's very similar. And then these are the mirror ones and you get six and they're very pretty. And they're big, they're really big. And you get, uh, it just says handmade, so I don't know. All right, so next, um, these are like food related or something like that. And I am gonna show you those. And some of them are the Crafter Square and then some are not. So I got these bottles and I'm sure you've seen them and I've recently seen them, so they still have them. But I think these are just so unique and pretty. And so I do have a couple of those. And then the mason jars, did you ever see those? And then the perfume bottles. These are just really, really pretty. And they're called foil stickers. Then, these are kind of food related because there's food on it. <laughs> so, love the little pineapple and the cupcake and ice cream cone. It's really kind of a summery, but I don't know. Then this is all just drinks, cute little coffee to go cup and iced tea and lemonade, really fun. And then this one has some yumminess on it, just makes you want to have something sweet to eat. It says enjoy this sweet moment. So what a fun card that would be. And then this one just makes you want to have Taco Tuesday right here, makes you hungry. And then look, what is that, an egg sandwich? I think it is, is that an egg sandwich? And then this looks like it's ice cream, like from Dairy Queen or something. I don't know. You guys, do, do you have a Dairy Queen where you are? All right, that's a duplicate, that's a duplicate, that's a duplicate, okay. I do sometimes buy two. All right, this one is one of my favorites and I have a hard time even using it because I like it. And it's so old fashioned looking and, well not old fashioned, but vintage. Old fashioned, vintage, vintage, yeah. Okay, and so it has this cute apron and this KitchenAid mixer. How long has KitchenAid, how long have KitchenAid mixers been around? Maybe I should look that up. That's a trivia question right there. We're stickerholics, remember? <laughs> okay. And then the pineapples, these are called pop-up, but all are oh so cute. And then these I fall for every time. Do you guys buy these wooden stickers? I love them. I have I just have to buy them. And these are the like pineapples and orange or lemon and watermelon. So cute. And then this one uh, has some painted or glitter. Now I have to show you something, just a second. Okay, I don't even know what I was recording. Something happened and the recorder didn't start. So I am gonna go back and share with you what I wanted to share with you. So side note on the wooden stickers like these, I had a demo last night I did for you guys called On the Marker Airbrush, and I painted these plain wooden stickers with, with the marker airbrush. And these are just plain, just like these, but these are not Dollar Tree, or these, and I just painted them like that. And then I decided to take a Dollar Tree frame and paint it, and look at this, how cool it is. This was just plain white. So anyway, marker airbrush, if you haven't seen it, no, I'm not selling it, and no, I don't get any kickback for it, but it's amazing, and I'm gonna have to do another demo, I think, or at least use it and make some things, because it's 
pretty cool. And they sell at HSN, if you're wondering. Okay. All right, so let's get on with the sticker haul. I don't know if I missed anything, but let's do this. So another decorative embellishment that the Dollar Tree had were these cute little button-looking stickers. So I did pick those up. That's a six-pack. And then they do sell, um, you know, like planner stickers. And so I'm going to show you some of the ones that I still have. These, and you get so many stickers, 56 stickers. I think there's four sheets in here. You get a ton. And then this one has, uh, this is a planner sticker. It actually doesn't say how many you get, but there's a lot. Can you see? How many of you do planners? I don't know. All right, here's another one. I don't know if that's exactly, yeah, I think it's the same as the other one where you get 56, and here is this one. You guys, there are tons. Do you ever find these or pick them up? They are, there are a lot. Planner stickers. Now here's another set. Really fun colors. And then they have these, these are 300. And these have words and happy faces and check marks and everything. And then they have the smaller packs like these. These are really fun. You have the blues and greens. And in these packs, this is 58. And then this one are the more like pastel colors, real pretty gem, gem looking, I don't know, gem looking, 58, okay. And then this one's very elegant looking. 58 stickers and then these two are the same so you get 58 total with those pretty stickers. Now I picked these up at Dollar Tree before and these are the little bubbles, the conversation bubbles and this is, um, let's see, 64 in each one and so I picked them up. I thought they would be fun. Alright, now this one I've had for quite some time and you can color these stickers. So I don't know if those that like to color have ever purchased these before, but they're really fun. They are tiny though. You'd have to have some really fine tip markers to do those. And then have you ever purchased these before from Dollar Tree? These are called paper tape. It's kind of like washi tape strips. And you get 16. Let's see, these two are the same. And then this one is a little bit different. This one's actually my favorite right here. I've used another one of these already. Okay, almost to the end, you guys, for part two. So I showed you these the other day. I picked up their Easter, actually, and they were 50 cents instead of a dollar. So I got two. And then so along the lines of the wood stickers, I do have some out. Some of my, all my Christmas stuff is really put away, but in the other room, but... Um, I had those and then the fall ones, which all my fall is packed up too, really. But I had these out too. And you could paint those. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Then I have these cute. Now these are Dollar Tree, but look again, you get the three uh, pages with the alpha. You get the alphas, and this is 77. It's called glitter, and it does have glitter. Um, on this one, so it's a little glittery. Then I have a, another a one that's birthday, so you get 72 here, and you could do some fun cards with these or scrapbook pages. And then this one is a birthday, but it's a little bit different. And these are these are more like pop up because they're they they stand out. And then I do did have these couple of um, you know alpha stickers that there's 72 in each one, and they do have numbers in them too, and some you know punctuation in there. And then last but not least, I'm going to show you these mosaic stickers and some gems. These I found at Dollar Tree, and they are just so beautiful. And they are stickers, so I've got one of each color: got the silver, the gold, the pink the green and the blue. And these are mirror tiles. 
and they are stickers and you can see their little squares and you can see the reflection so that's pretty cool and then they have these this is called diamond wrap in the floral section so not in the sticker section and this is actually um, has sticker adhesive on the back and then the gemstone stickers you've probably seen those and they have all kinds of colors so I just thought I'd show you one and that one of course is green and then they have these jewel stickers these are fairly new at least to me and they're very long and those are cool because jewel border and here's another color scheme with the little pearls and then they've been carrying these fashion gems that you can buy to put on things and they come with glue and i decided to show you those they're not really stickers but they're similar and they then they give you the glue to stick them on and so that's the end of my haul for part two. I hope you enjoyed looking at my stickers with me. It sure made me want to use them and remember everything that I have. And I do have them kind of sorted where I have them put away. At one point, I was so sorted that I just, you know, like couldn't find anything anyway. So I just put them all together in one bin. And so, you know, they're not as organized as probably some, but it's easy for me to find them. So that's what counts. So I hope you enjoyed this haul. I hope it'll inspire you to do something with your stickers and stick together as stickerholics. And thanks for watching and have a good night.